Hello there guys. Okay, today I want to be looking at how to be um, how to create your own reusable control. A reusable control is um, a control that you built. Um, it has a specific functionality that you wanted to do, and um, you can then create this control and reuse it in any uh, project or application that you do in the future. So it's a it's a nice nice method if you um, do programming in a certain area and um, you reuse or rebuild the same controls over and over and over again. You can fully customize your own controls and everything like that. What I've done is I've just created a um, user control for myself and it's quite easy. All I did is I went to create a new project. You select Windows Forms Control. Alright. You give it a name, click OK. It'll then give you the blank, um, the, the gray blank um, panel that you can actually put your control on. All I did was I've added a, um, a group box. Um, I've also added the two labels, the two text boxes and a button. I named it convert. And I went onto the internet and I found the calculation to convert from Celsius to Fahrenheit, which is 9 divided by 5 multiplied by the total Celsius plus 32 degrees and um, I have put that into my buttons code. So that's the only line of code I have. Okay. And uh, let's go and test our control quickly. So what I need to do is I go lay and you can now see that um, because it's a user control the user control is in this little um, item that allows you to um, just see some of the basic properties of that control. Okay. You can even test your control straight from here. So I know that 20 degrees, uh, if I convert it, should be 68, which is correct. Okay, so our converter works fine. We close that. Okay, so um, my basic control is finished. So what I need to do first of all is I need to save it. So um, I've already saved it under um, a, sorry, a name called uh, Temp Convert. Alright, and for me to be able to use it in other applications, I need to go build and build the, the temp convert pro, um, control. Sorry, I'm a bit confused this morning. Okay, so now that the build has succeeded at the bottom there, we can now go and use our control in other applications. So to do that, I'm going to create a new project, a Windows Forms application. I'm going to call it test. Click OK. And this would be a new project okay um, so let's say for example my new project needs for me to have a um, converter in it all I need to do is go to my toolbox and you only need to do this once alright I've already got my own YouTube control that I've built before but I want to add um, my converter in so all I do is right click go choose items okay in the .NET framework components we're going to browse and I know it's in my documents 2008 project and I call the temp control there we are, temp convert okay and in the bin folder you'll have a release and that is your driver, that is your control over there okay click on open and there you go it's open um, user control 1 click OK and there we go we can now drag and drop our control and there you go as simple as that all I need to do is play because the codes already in it 2068 okay so you can obviously um, do that over and over in any, any container or any project that you have even if you do it two or three times it really doesn't matter it is a control an independent control that you can use wherever and whenever you want so if you have any questions, you can post them. You can subscribe to my channel if you want. Um, any questions are all welcome. And I will speak to you later. Cheers.